guys, Leanne here, I'm Grady's mom. In today's video, I wanted to share with you guys some athletic, but still looks that aren't frumpy ideas. About twice a week, I do the athletic look. It's not really even planned, it just works. So a couple times a week, I find myself wearing, again, the athletic look, which are a lot of like yoga pants or workout pants or sweatshirts or little jackets like this. Um, but I try to do it in a way that doesn't look frumpy because in the past, I used to just throw on any sweatpants and a big old sweatshirt, and I'm not saying we can't have those days because we all do, but I like to feel good about the way that I look. It just helps me have a better day and feel happier about life in general, and I know as women, a lot of us struggle with self-esteem or, you know, wanting to be, you know, younger or skinnier or whatever the case may be. It's just sort of what society has done to us, but I want to show you guys that you can still do the athletic look and be comfortable, but also still look put together and not frumpy. So a lot of times I, you know, mix and match a lot of my pieces. So I'm going to show you some ideas of outfits I actually wear on a regular basis. And a lot of the pieces I mix and match with each other and then throw in additional pieces as well. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and hopefully you're all having a great day and I will see you guys very soon and I hope you enjoy. Bye guys. Hey guys, so my first look in this video, again, this is for athletic looks that are not frumpy, is this outfit here. Both of these pieces are from Target. These cropped pants here, I'll give you a closer look, are one of my favorite pairs of athletic pants. They are very, very form-fitting, but also super comfortable, and they are cropped, so the length works really well on me since I'm only 5'4". And most people, I feel like, would take a really safe route with these pants, which I have done with just a simple white or black solid top. But when I found this hoodie at Target recently, the pants are from last year, the hoodie is from recently, I just thought it would look really cute together. Now the blue doesn't match perfectly, as you can see. There are a little bit of undertones here, but it's not a perfect match. However, it does work. Um, and I really like these two pieces together. I love the combination of the form-fitting pants with a pop of color and pattern with a sort of muted, kind of easy, breezy hoodie. And it's very lightweight and easy to wear. And I actually just throw these on with my Nikes, which are black, and they have some pink and purple accents on them. And this is a super cute outfit for errands or the gym or just any kind of anything you can think of. It's just a really easy outfit to wear and it's not frumpy at all. This second look is a very simple black and white look. I just took these black regular cotton leggings from Target. These are the cropped ones that only come out in the spring and summer. I, you really can't find them too much in the winter, um, or at least I haven't been able to find them, but they are just black, cropped, regular old cotton leggings. I think they were all of $10 from Target. And this hoodie is actually from that same line, which I'll show you guys the brand, Modern Lux, which is the same company that makes the blue California hoodie. It's actually the same exact hoodie, but this is all black with white stripes. Again, that uh, the line is Modern Lux, and I got this hoodie recently at Target. It's very lightweight, also very easy breezy, ready to wear, easy to wear, and I really like the, again, form-fitting pants, cropped, the length is perfect for me, with this easy to throw on hoodie, and then I just throw on, again, my black Nikes with it. And I just like to accessorize with a few, maybe, bracelets or a pretty watch if you have one, and honestly, these looks, it's just so easy it just doesn't get any easier than a pair of leggings with a hoodie but at the same time that look does not have to be frumpy so I really love this look together so much this next look is also super easy these pants I got at Target in the athletic section they are the champion brand which we all know of. These are a different material than my than your regular cotton leggings. Um, it says Duo Dry, and they are made of polyester and spandex, so they have a different feel uh, since they're not cotton. Also, they are cropped, and they have this black strip down the side, as well as uh, a little bit dipping down onto the bottom. 
and a really nice charcoal gray color. And I just pair this, uh, these pants. A lot of times I pair it with this hoodie, which is super lightweight. It's just a Nike hoodie. I got this a few years ago, I believe, at a Nike outlet for really, really cheap. I really liked the coral color. It just adds a nice pop of color, and I like that it's really lightweight since I run really warm. And then I just threw a plain old black flowy scoop neck t-shirt underneath it. Um, this is just one idea. I've also worn these pants with a long sleeve white shirt. I've also done a black hoodie, but I do like to implement a little bit of pop of color when I can with a hoodie or maybe an undershirt that is peeking out. So again, really, really easy outfit. These are Ganner from Target. This hoodie is a couple years old from a Nike outlet. And then this black scoop neck t-shirt I believe I just got at Marshall's last year. So a very inexpensive outfit and also not frumpy and still has that nice clean athletic look. I really love this next look. I got these pants at Target recently. I actually shared these pants in my new series, Sharing My Finds. They are cropped, but a longer length of crop, so they go right above my ankle bone. If you are somebody taller than 5'4", or maybe have longer legs, they will probably look a bit more cropped on you, but I really, really like them. I actually ended up returning the ones I showed in my video, which, which were a medium, and going for the small, um, because I found that when I tried to wear the medium, they just were a little bit saggy, like in the crotch area, so I did just exchange them for the same exact ones in a small, and they seem to work better on my body. I've actually been pairing these with this neon yellow. It's almost so neon that it's showing up almost white, but it's like a true neon yellow color, a little bit muted. This I got at Saks Fifth Avenue Outlet. Uh, it's just a Calvin Klein performance hoodie. This was in the athletic section. Again, super lightweight. All of my hoodies tend to be lightweight since I run warm. I really like this hoodie because not only is it lightweight, but it covers my butt, which I like when I'm wearing leggings. And I've just been throwing on this black sort of waffle knitted scarf with this. Um, this is just a regular scarf, but I've actually turned it into an infinity scarf. I did a video on how to turn any scarf into an infinity scarf. If anybody would like to check that out, I will link it down below. So I just pair this with this hoodie. It just gives the neckline a little bit more dimension and a little bit more style. And I love wearing this when I have to run out really early in the morning. It's super cozy and also really, really comfortable. This next look I absolutely love because I have a bunch of these Lily Pulitzer pop-over sort of sweatshirts. Um, however, they're kind of more of a... I don't even know how to explain it, guys, but they're not really a sweatshirt material. They have a little bit of spandex to them, so they're a bit fitted. They're also lightweight. I absolutely love this one. And of all my Lily Pulitzer popovers, this is my favorite one. The print is called Scuba to Cuba. Now, these are more, much more expensive than your normal sweatshirt, so I only get probably one to two at the most of these popovers. I try to get a, at least one to two per year um, because they are very expensive. Um, but I really like them because not only can you dress them up with jeans and jewelry and boots, you can also rock them with kind of a more athletic pant. Um, I don't really recommend, me personally, I wouldn't wear this with leggings because it wouldn't cover my butt, but I do like to wear it with cropped kind of workout pants. These are just TJ Maxx, like regular jockey brand athletic pants. Let me show you guys the back of these. The back has on the bottom this really cool little sort of flap that folds over, um, which is a little bit more loose as well, so they don't fit really, really skin tight on the bottom like normal leggings. So I like pairing my popovers with these type of pants. I actually have a few of these pants because when I find really good fitting athletic pants for a good price, I usually tend to get two or three pairs at a time. I think these were all of like $14.99, again, at TJ Maxx, um, and Marshalls is another good place to look. So I really like pairing my a little bit more dressy and vibrant popovers with these workout pants, some sneakers, a couple bracelets, make sure my hair and makeup are on point, and it really can turn just your basic 
black workout pants into a little bit more of an outfit that looks pulled together. So I really love that. I really hope you guys enjoy these looks and the pictures and I definitely want to do more of these videos. So if you have ideas for specific types of videos you want to see that are fashion related, just comment down below and let me know. Hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you very soon. Bye guys.